damn it, you punk ass mutant bastard. You think throwing me down this hole is going to defeat me? I'm invincible, unkillable. The red, white, and blue flows through my veins. You may think you've seen the last. Damn it, kid, are you listening to me? What the hell is that? You son of a bitch, don't you dare ignite that missile! No, no! Damn you, mutant bastard! Ah! Sorry, kid. No time for chit chat. You made it back out. Everything inside that building dead? Good. What's going on with that bomb? They had another base? You're joking. Where the hell was it? Holy Hannah! And you actually managed to program the Merv to hit them all at once? That's insane! If we can confirm your story, you have just saved the NCR from a far more deadly conflict down the road. That's incredible work. Really? Outstanding. Which makes this next part all that much harder. God, I'm sorry, kid. I hate to be the one to do this to you. NCR Brass caught wind of what you are. They know what that mutant told you about Project Brazil living in your body. They know what you can do. Some of them wanted to put you in jail for what you've done, to take the fall for me. Others want to cut you open, but I've got an alternative. There's a military base up north called Navarro. It's an ex-enclave holdout, one of the NCR's best research facilities. They need a new special agent, like you, a courier protecting vital packages on their way between secure facilities. I want you to head up there to Navarro with that launch key to the dagger point system you triggered. It may solve a problem they're having. You can take this new mission from me, or they put you away someplace dark. It's up to you. It's not up to me anymore, kid. I took it as far up as it'll go, right to the man at the top. He said no. He offered me only these two options to extend to you, out of courtesy to me. This is all I can offer. I'm sorry. So what'll it be? Go to jail, or take another mission on for me? I'm sure it will. Now that we're tapped into the president's desk, you can charge whatever you want. I'm going to have to ask you to leave your companions behind for now. President didn't ask for them, just you. I'll make sure they're well taken care of and set up at some place nice. You'll be able to pay them a visit every now and again. I wish this had ended different. You deserve a break after all you've been through. But I have a feeling you'll hear that a lot. War never changes, kid. Come on, let's get a move on. The war for California is over. While the embers of Fort Dagger Point still glow, the Raider tribes are conquered by the NCR military. What few super mutants and Raiders remain flee to the far corners of the wasteland. With Eldragon dead and the Bishop family forced into retreat, the pass finally finds itself bathed in the tide of civilization. The local tribes are pacified, the land reclaimed, 
and the road to the Mojave is finally free for explorers to travel. The NCR soon discovers Hoover Dam and the long-lost city of glittering lights. Their next step is to invade the Mojave. They will continue to rapidly expand from Mexico to the far northern frontier, bringing an era of prosperity, however short-lived. As for you, you chose to launch Fort Dagger Point's missile array against the Enclave, destroying Fort Dagger Point's FEV reserves and crippling their operations across America. But they soon recover in the Far East and rise again to use their anti-FEV serum, secured by Colonel Bragg, to menace another hero from Vault 101. This act of courage wins you no friends among the NCR. General Silverman finds himself disgraced and exiled to the far northern frontier, where he is sentenced to serve out the remainder of his days alone in a desolate mist. You settle your remaining allies in the town of Hopeville. Not long after the town begins to prosper, the Fort Dagger Point key you kept with you all those years triggers the self-destruct on the town's arsenal of buried nuclear weapons. Your healing powers keep you alive, but slowly begin to wane after you crawl out of the newly created Divide. Eventually, you settle on a job as a courier, carrying packages through the dangerous wasteland to get by. After picking up a unique platinum chip from a mysterious dealer, you find yourself brought to your knees in a graveyard just outside Good Springs. You got what you were after, so pay up. You're crying in the rain, Pally. <laughs> Guess who's waking up over here? Time to cash out. Will you get it over with? Maybe cons kill people without looking them in the face. But I ain't a fink, dig? You've made your last delivery, kid. Sorry you got twisted up in this scene. From where you're kneeling must seem like an 18 karat run of bad luck. Truth is, the game was rigged from the start. <laughs>